so glad to finally be home. I mean, don't get me wrong, that vacation was very much needed. But, gosh. Oh, that traveling stresses me out. I was starting to get a headache on the way home. Yeah, there were two days that I had to take my headache medicine, but I think that was just stress of traveling in a new environment. I'm feeling okay right now. And, uh, just got back. I'm glad we stopped at the store before we, um, you know, like, came home and everything. Like, actually stopped at home. Yeah. <laughs> No, I'm I'm all right, honey. I just I'm still getting used to the whole vacationing thing, you know. Nothing wrong with it, of course. It's just I'm not used to <laughs> vacations. Yeah. Uh, my family would every now and then, but we often it would take a year or two before we could afford to, so it's kind of uh, crazy how quickly we've been able to go on vacation since, well, since I've known you. The traveling part was probably the most stressful, but I feel like overall I did pretty good, don't you? I mean, I was a little anxious, yeah, I won't lie, but it wasn't anything I couldn't handle. So it was nice. You are incredibly helpful, you know that? In keeping me calm and recognizing those things? I don't know where I would be without you. I would probably be still in the airport. <laughs> How did you feel about the turbulence? Yeah, it was pretty windy flying home. No, it didn't really bother me at all. I mean, there wasn't a whole lot you can do in that instance, so I kind of just tried to ignore it. Pretend I was on a train or something. <laughs> something a little less intimidating than plummeting from the sky, but God kept us safe, and I'm very grateful for that. He allowed us to have a wonderful vacation together. It really was wonderful. I had a ton of fun, and your family is so nice and so generous, especially paying for everything. Like, they didn't have to do that. We we planned on spending money. They know that, right? Well, yeah. At least I planned on spending money. Mm-hmm. Well, I don't want them paying for us, for everything. We worked hard for our money, and, you know, I was raised where you get what you earn. And I feel like I didn't earn any of that. I just kind of existed. And some people say that's enough, but I don't know. Maybe I'm just being weird. Definitely could be the case. I am pretty strange. <laughs> yeah. No, no, I, I am. I'm, I'm okay. Just... <sighs> coming down from it. I think I'm gonna cancel our plans for tomorrow evening. I'm just peopled out. <laughs> yeah. Nothing wrong with them, you know, I'm just, the. <laughs> I'm done for a little bit. Yeah. I love them all very, very much, but I'm tired. <laughs> no, no, honey, it wasn't your family, it was just... 
there was a lot going on, and I don't know. Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. Just... <sighs> hey, why don't we just unpack and unwind, yeah? Yeah, that's all, all that I want right now. Is to just unpack and not have to worry about anything. That's what I'm thinking about, anyways. It's not worrying. <laughs> oh my goodness, honey. Do you remember the mountain that we climbed? Yeah, it was beautiful. I've never seen anything like it before. Yeah. I... I don't know. <laughs> It was stunning, and the sunsets, it was, oh, so wonderful. Thank you for that. There's many times I don't get to appreciate those kinds of things. Yeah, so I really appreciate it. Your family is very kind. And they made me feel very welcome. Yeah, they did. Oh, the food. Uh, yeah, it was good. Yeah, I had lobster for the first time. The claw was better than the tail, like I said, but seafood really isn't my thing. It tasted like corn. Yeah, and not just because of the butter, because I tried it without butter, thinking it was, you know, just the butter. It was not. <laughs> It it tasted very strange to me. Yeah. I mean, it was good, and I, I enjoyed it, yes, but it tasted like butter. <laughs> so, it was kind of weird. Would I eat it again? Um, probably? Maybe? If I had a bunch of options, that would not be my first pick. No. <laughs> I enjoyed it, yeah. Just... It's not something I would eat again. You know? Mm-hmm. Well, <laughs> it was a great vacation. But... Ugh, I am sore from that hike. And the ocean right there, too, it was, oh, it was just so stunning. Up on the hike, you could hear the roar of the ocean on the way, on the, on the rocks, the waves on the rocks, and... <sighs> huh? Live there? Oh, absolutely not. No, I don't think I could live in Maine. It's beautiful, yeah, but not somewhere I would enjoy being all the time. If you know what I mean. Nothing against it, of course. It's just not my cup of tea. That's all. I, I told you, hun. I enjoyed it. It's just... Not for me. That's all. Yeah. I mean, we can definitely go back to visit someday, of course. I want to see your family again. I'm not going to keep you from them. No, absolutely not. Why Why would you get the idea that I wanted to do that? The last thing I want is for you to never see your family again. They're your family. They're going to be with you no matter what happens. They love you. Just like how I love you. Did you really get that idea? Well, no, sweetheart. Of course I want you to see your family. Whenever we get the chance. I just... I want to start our own. Here. Well, you know the saying, it takes a village. If I had 
raised a kid before... Well, before, then maybe my opinion would be a little different, but... I, I've never done it before, and personally, honestly, I don't trust myself doing it alone. Well, no, but you would be working, and... Uh, honey, I don't want to get into this right now. I love you, but... We just got home from vacation. Can we relax, please? You know how I always miss home when we're away. I know we haven't been gone long, it's just... <sighs> Honey, I love you. And I want to talk about this because I know it's important. But right now, I just need to sit down and relax. I don't want to talk about this when I'm stressed out. Because then it's going to turn into an argument, and I don't want that. No. We can talk about this another time, okay? Let's just sit and relax. Thank you. I love you. And you mean the whole world to me. It was a great vacation, and I loved seeing your grandparents, and we can visit them another time very soon, I promise. A pinky pie promise? <sighs> Cross my heart and hope to fly, stick a cupcake in my eye. There. A pinky pie promise. <laughs> I love you. And only you. Tell you what. Why don't we pray about this more? Yeah. See where God wants us to go. What he wants us to do. Because ultimately, he's the decider of everything anyways. So, it's kind of up to him. If you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to pray right now? Hmm. Okay. Go ahead. Amen. Good job, sweetie. Now, tell me, what was your favorite part of vacation? Mm-hmm. Yeah, what was your favorite thing that we did, or saw, or talked about, or experienced? <laughs> I want to know how you're feeling about it. Oh my gosh, yeah! That place was so cool! It was awesome that we got to visit. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. No, I mean it. I did. Yeah. That hat you found was so cute. I'm glad you bought it. Mm-hmm. It looks great on you. I mean, everything does, but still. I'm allowed to compliment you, aren't I? <laughs> <sighs> yeah, that, that should be everything. Mm hmm But, um, since we're all unpacked, how about we, uh, get some rest, yeah? I am so excited to sleep in our own beds tonight. Yeah. I have missed them dearly. You know I'm a very picky sleeper. <laughs> now, come on.
Let's lay down, yeah? Yeah, I agree. We deserve some rest. <laughs> Good night, my sweet.